hello guys welcome back in this video i am unboxing new plants for my planted aquarium i bought it from aquabynature.com so if you are in india and want to buy some aquatic plants then this is the best site for you i dropped the link in the video description you can check it out from here so i ordered a couple of plants namely jungle wild amanthus cuba and java moss seeing at the package they are packed in good conditions a sealed pack is used to ship the plant so nothing bad at shipment so this is a jungle wall i ordered but uh, since jungle wall was not available on their website i ordered some other plant this is a hemanthus cuba pot so some damage has occurred to the leaves so i have to remove some damaged leaves and then plant them in my planter aquarium by the way i ordered the jungle wall and this is not the jungle wall this is some same bigger variety of jungle wall called americana valisneria gigantea some weird name is given and then i bought the hemanthus calitori uh, calitroids cuba pot So this is a very hard plant to grow it requires high CO2 high fertilizer level and more lightning so this is a advanced level plant i am trying it out since i am a beginner planted aquarist it is not recommended for me but i am trying it out so this plant is not shipped properly i think this should be shipped in a in a container without substrate because most of the leaves have been damaged you can see that many leaves have damaged some leaf is left that can be planted in the aquarium so i will be keeping this in my planted aquarium when more of the leaves come out then i will plant them in the planted aquarium i bought three pots of them and uh, most of the leaves have been damaged so this was the jungle wild i am talking about this is not a jungle wild this is called valisneria americana gigantea so this is a variety of jungle wild that can be used on the background and it is already looking good at the background you can see i have transferred it to the discus tank and it is looking very great this cannot be used on my small planter aquarium so i will be using it in the discus aquarium this is my planter aquarium small nano planter tank so the plants that i ordered like java moss and amanthus cuba can be planted here So I'm keeping the Amanthus cuba pot in the aquarium since it is damaged and requires more leaves to come out. So when it grows out to a good condition, I will plant them in my planter aquarium. So if you are also trying Amanthus cuba, make sure that you are using a CO2 cylinder because CO2 is must for this plant. and also fertilizer is also required a good foundation is also required for hemanthus cuba this is the hemanthus cuba pot i have kept it inside my planted aquarium when it will become lush green again i will plant them separately this is a good carpeting plant and it requires co2 injection Also, you require iron, potassium, and some stresszyme for uh, aquarium which requires hemanthus cuba or any other plants that require high CO2 and fertilizer level. So, I have a cheap do-it-yourself CO2 cylinder. I have ma made a video about it. You can check them in the cards above, and it will help you to grow the hard plants like advanced plants like hemanthus cuba. so they required co2 cylinder 
so check the cards and you can build a cheap co2 diffuser using the method described in the video so in couple of weeks they will be growing out and i will be planting them till then you have to wait and if you are new to this channel you have to subscribe my channel to watch the upcoming videos so that's it for this unboxing of new plants and where to get them i have dropped links in the video description you can check them out until next video bye and take care and thanks for watching